Hi folks, this is all the fruit and here I have Crategos pedicellata or pedicellata the scarlet hawthorn or scarlet thorn one of the countless species of hawthorn which are spread throughout the temperate and subtropical areas of the northern hemisphere I think there are a couple hundred species in East Asia, also a couple hundred in North America, but there is also a quite a sizable number of hawthorn species in Europe. Well, Crategus pedicerata is from North America. Hawthorns are quite important as fruit trees. Well, basically they were quite important as fruit trees in older times. Nowadays, they are a little bit less important, like in China, I think they still use the Chinese hawthorn a lot. In the Mediterranean, Crategos azarolos was a very popular fruit tree, the azarol thorn. Why? Well, when I lived in Malta, I found out why. Crategos azarolos tastes like apples, but most of their apple varieties ripen in June. So if you want apples in autumn, in September, October, you have to plant hawthorn and the fruit will taste like apples. Crategus pedicellata, the fruit also tastes like really good aromatic apples. Here on the Heidelberg University campus, there is a number of Crategus pedicellata trees and shrubs. Usually, well, it can be a shrub, it can be a small tree. And basically for many years I've been walking around trying them out and I know the tastiest ones. This is one of the tasty ones, but not one of the tastiest ones. Why am I doing the video with this one? Well, we had kind of drought stress the last two years, so a lot of the tasty ones this year are so drought stressed that they are not really tasty. But this one is quite okay. Yeah, the birds also love them. There are thousands of tiny feral plants of Crategus pedicellata on campus. This here could be one. Yeah, it could be a sucker, but it could also be a little seedling. As you can see, the harvest is quite plentiful despite the drought. There are still thousands of fruit on the shrub. There are thousands of fruit on the ground. If you think this is a lot, think again. Look, all those red fruit, if you remove them, you will see that they are basically lying on a densely packed layer of the remnants of the rotten fruit from last year. So even one year after they fell to the ground, they are still covering the ground completely. And so you can also see what the seeds of Crategus pedicellata look like. Those are pebbles, but those here are the seeds still arranged like if they still were in the fruit. Okay now, Let's take a couple of the of this year's fruit. You can also pick them from the plant when they seem ripe enough. Well, when they are lying on the ground, you don't know what animals have run over them, but when they are still on the plant, you cannot always judge which one are ripe enough. So I'm picking the ones from the ground. Let's try them. Mm -hmm. It's like a soft aromatic apple. The scarlet thorn is not as apple-like as the Azarol thorn. But I think pretty much everybody who eats it will use the word apple if they have to describe the taste. I mean Crategus is quite a close relative of the apple. Both are in the subfamily Maloidea of the Rosaceae. Maloidea are apples and similar fruit. Yeah, the taste basically, some are really crunchy like an apple, but in this shrub, the ripe fruit are, oops, soft. Yeah like a soft aromatic apple 
Among the Hawthorns, which you can commonly find in Germany, this is the tastiest one I know. And also it provides really ample harvest. Sometimes I've picked big bags full of this stuff, like 10, 20 kilograms from one plant in one harvest, and I still barely scratch the surface. <coughs> I think if you harvested all the fruit from a big shrub, you could get 50, 60, 70 kilograms. And the fruit, yeah, this is more or less the average size. <coughs> in moist years, they can get bigger, but basically they are the size of cherries, the color of cherries, and the taste of apples. Yeah, the best Hawthorn you can easily get in Germany. There are a couple tastier Hawthorn species, but you'll have to go to botanic gardens to find them. And all the native Hawthorn species, mm, they pale in comparison with this one. Quite a tasty fruit, but don't eat too much of it. Hawthorn is a heart medicine, so it will strengthen your heart and increase your increase the function of your functioning of your heart so if you eat too much your heart can basically get a little bit too excited so don't eat a kilogram or two of those it may be a handful or two of those that never harmed me mm. okay folks so this was Crategus pedicellata the tastiest of all the Crategus species you can easily find in Germany. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the parks and gardens of Germany. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.